Hey, what is up guys, Klaus Nice here, and today I'm gonna to talk about hormones, in particular, cortisol. If you're not already familiar, cortisol is the hormone that is stress, it's the stress hormone. So when you're feeling really stressed out with life, that's cortisol pumping through your veins. Now cortisol can make it a lot harder for you to lose fat, and here's why. When you have increased stress in life, you have increased cortisol going through your body, which also means that your insulin levels are also going to increase. And as a result of the increased insulin, your blood sugar is gonna drop. What's gonna happen then? You're gonna start to want sugary foods. You're gonna start to want fatty foods. You're gonna start to crave junk food. It's gonna make you wanna overeat. It's gonna make you wanna snack. It's this huge domino effect that starts with feeling stress. So when all the other factors in your life, you know, towards living a healthy lifestyle or losing fat, seem to be working out for you, like you seem to be doing everything right, your routine's good, eating's good. If you're living a stressed out life, then it's gonna affect your fat loss. So cortisol is gonna make it harder for you if you're a stress eater, stress snacker, you know, or you're in general a stressed out person. So this video isn't about how to deal with your stress because you probably already know what makes you de-stress and there's lots of different methods out there for de-stressing. So if fat loss is something you're struggling with, you might want to consider de-stressing yourself, especially since stress or cortisol is anabolic to fat and is catabolic to muscle, which also means if you have a lot of cortisol going through your body, it's gonna even be harder on a biological level for you to break down fat, let alone the cravings. All right, that's gonna do it for this video. I hope you guys learned something, hope it was informative. Don't stress, eat, de-stress. Klaus next out.